try it and see. All right, here we go. On three, you ready? One, two, three. All right, good. Rock. All right, did you guys like that? Yes, did you like that? It's all about inspiration. You know, this whole museum is all about inspiring wonder. That is our foundational mission, and uh, it's very, very important to give people the freedom to be able to pursue that thinking. A lot of times what we'll find is that people have uh, visited other parts of the museum, um, maybe down in the aquarium or in the rainforest, and they'll come up here and they'll try to recreate some of what they've seen in foil or in fabric or in tape. It's extraordinary what the kids come up with when you let them go and just give them uh, something to work with. Another one? Yes, put them down here. What I like about the rainforest is that uh, we have tried to capture the fact that the rainforests are layered and there's structure, there's vertical structure. Obviously, there's the canopy, there's the forest floor, and there's everything between. And what we tried to capture is that there are actually living things and organisms at every single level. And so, again, in an urban setting, to be able to capture the stratification or the layers of the rainforest is extraordinary. This lab is actually called the Explore More Stuff Lab, and each of the stations is geared to a different level of sophistication of knowledge to enter into physics. So the idea is to get people to play in order to enter into the concepts of physics and chemistry. This is a show we do every day, it's called Fired Up, where we really get to uh, teach people a little bit of fire safety, while at the same time a little bit of the chemistry and exciting stuff behind fire. So this is the copper two chloride, this is the lithium, strontium, and copper. There's a lot of things to memorize in science class, and that's really important. But, you know, losing some of that wonder, some of that excitement, some of the, the cool factor, something that really drops your jaw, um, they lose some of that. And here, we get to give some of that back to them. We're at Dilworth Elementary School. Uh, we're doing the Atrium Reaction class, which is all about um, physical and uh, chemical reactions. Remember earlier, we talked about there are some reactions that can give you a temperature change. This is one of them. The value of bringing the learning outside of Discovery Place is a lot of the kids don't actually get the chance to come to Discovery Place. So um, if we can bring it to them, that means that they'll get the science even though they don't get to come to our facility. We want to really wow people with the possibilities of science. The more engaging we can make them, take them away from what people's preconceived notions are about science, dry, boring, tedious, to, to show the excitement level that can happen when you just let yourself imagine and let yourself explore.